Well, hey everybody, and welcome to Kiki's Kitchen. I have not been live in such a very long time. I've almost forgotten how to do all this. So thank you so much for joining me this afternoon. Um, I, I'm gonna just see here if I can pull it up here on my own. Um, so, cause what I try to do is I try to, I, I'm, I'm talking to you through my phone and then I've got my um, live going here on my iPad so that I can um, see your comments and, and try to talk back and try to answer some questions. So, hey, Gloria, let me see if I can get these comments going here so that I can see who all is watching. Um, I see Gloria and, you know, sometimes I feel like, remember, uh, what was her name? Miss, well, it's depending on where you lived in the world, you know, Miss, Miss Peck, Miss Peggy, Miss whatever, and I see Bonnie, and I see Amy, <laughs> but hi, everybody, and thank you so much. I'm telling you, um, I have had 1,600 people wish me a happy birthday today, and honestly, I, I, I can't even begin to even give you all 1,600 hearts. I mean, I, mm, thank you so much. I truly, truly, truly do appreciate that. Um, I'm seeing if I can, I don't know which way to look, whether I'm looking up here or down there. So, but it's been a really, really long time, um, kind of over the bulk of the winter, to tell you the honest truth. Hi from Arizona, Brenda, Debbie, Ryan. Um, so good to see you all and, or hear from you all anyway. I mean, I, I recognize so many names from comments and trust me on the comment thing. I truly, I sit down at night and I start to read comments. Um, Hmm. Well, my little girl Raleigh is trying to join and it's not going to let her and I'm not sure why. So come on, Raleigh, keep trying. Um, but, you know, I, I, I really do read comments um, and I try to get to as many as I can. And then, you know what, somebody, you know, sends me a comment from a, um, from a video I did like a year ago. And, um, and I'm like, oh my gosh, there are 10, 10 comments here I never ever saw. So sometimes you hear from me, it's a year later, but sometimes, oh, well, how do I do this? Somebody wants to join me on the video. Whoops. I wanted to see if there was a way for me to push a button and let you, but I don't know how to do that. So, um, but I've had a wonderful day. Um, hey, Gary, my cousin Gary. He's like one of my favorite humans. Hi, bud. Um, and there's my Raleigh Ruff. Happy birthday, Aunt Kiki. See that? Look at that pretty Raleigh Ruff. Well, you can't really see her picture, but I know how beautiful she is. She is another one of my very few, my very favorite, um, humans. And then you'll see one that says Kiki's Kitchen. It says happy birthday, BFF. And that is our friend Denise. And, um, she has a, she's an administrator. So when she, um, when she comments, it comes up as Kiki's Kitchen. So, hello, my BFF and my BFF and Raul. I'm so glad you made it on here. Raul is my, one of my junior cooks, and um, I love cooking with her. She's hilarious. I'm telling you, there's one that we did. Oh gosh, Almighty! I think it was last June, and we did one for um, a caprese salad. Now she doesn't really touch. Thank you, Gare. Um, she doesn't really touch many vegetables, but she is a great helper. She'll 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 chop chop and di um, dice anything. So, um, not that I'm you know I have no grandchildren. She's my great niece, so you know she's perfect. So, anyway, um, today has been great. I got up this morning. I came out to a blazing birthday can uh, cake filled with, uh, which is a carrot cake, which is honestly one of my very, very favorite cakes in the world, but I don't know anyone else who, who eats it. So my husband, um, so my husband, um, gets it for me on my birthday and he just gets, well, it's a small one, but it's still a pretty good sized cake. So it's going to have to go to the freezer because I can't be left alone with that much carrot cake. That's for sure. As I'm blabbering along, I'm seeing so many people coming up, and it's so great to see you all. Um, I'm, I'm reading names as they come through, and all my birthday wishes, and I so appreciate that. Um, I did have lunch with my um, golf ladies today. We went to a little place here in town called The Mill House. They have fabulous pizza. And um, so I got to catch up with them, and that was great. So... Um, Came back home. My husband's off today, and so it's been a, it's been a really good day. So I figured I'd end it up with talking with you guys. So 
Um, I did want to tell you a few things. Let's see. Um, I do have a couple of videos. You know, the last, honestly, I lost my, my, um, um, blah, 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 internet and they, and I forget what it was, but it was something outside. And, um, um, so I haven't had internet since last Thursday. And while I could make a hotspot with my phone to power something else, um, honestly, I couldn't, I, I mean, I could barely post a picture, much less a video, so that wasn't happening. So, I do have a couple of videos, though, to post. Um, I just didn't get a chance to do it today, because I had some running around to do this morning. So, I've got one of Chicken Divan, which is an old 70s favorite, made with chicken and, um, sour cream and soup and, and, uh, broccoli. And then I have another one of some homemade spaghetti sauce using, um, a pork shoulder. So I'll post those probably in the morning because I have some plans for tonight. And um, so I'll, I'll post them in the morning. Um, and then I'm, I've got a few more things I'm going to be making this week. I'm going to be making some authentic Swedish um, Swedish meatballs. And um, I do actually have some Swede in my background um, my, on my mother's side. So I have an old Swedish meatball recipe, which... Swedish meatballs are, are um, unlike Italian meatballs because they have warmer spices in them, like nutmeg and allspice. So, and they're done in a beef sour cream gravy. Really good. So, we'll be doing some of that. So, let me look at some of these comments. They're coming in fast and furious. How many people? Gosh almighty, we already have 300 people um, <clears throat> joining us. So, I haven't seen anything else from my girl. Um, let's see here. I see so many of you almost that, that I just, I see comments from all the time and it's just so good. And thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. Um, I am going to be making a few, uh, some, some, a lot of appetizers kind of coming up. So, um, um, Michael McDaniel, I used to work with a Michael McDaniel, but I don't think you're the same one. Um, um, but hi, and thanks for watching. And, um, but I'm going to be making some, some appetizers because I've got a few events coming up that um, are going to be kind of big appetizer things. So I'm going to test drive a few things so that I can, I can get them out in, in mass. You know, it's one thing to make, you know, appetizers for a group of six. It's another thing to do appetizers for a group of 50. So I'm going to be working on that and that's going to be kind of something new. Um, I am going to see my BFF very soon. Um, I can't believe I don't have the exact, uh, I, my exact number because by this time we're usually doing a countdown. But I'm going to go with, um, I'm going to go with about 40 days. We usually, and, and I'll be more specific soon. I expect, where are you BFF? How many days have we got? Um, and I'm flying up there and and I'll be up there from the 16th of May. No, the 16th, is that it? Uh, I think so, something like that. To June 4th, I get like a little bit over two weeks with my BFF. And it's just my BFF and me. So um, my husband will be here on his own. Poor baby, sob, sob, oh well. And um, we will be up there making each other giggle until our sides hurt. So that's a good thing. Uh, she needs a little TLC and I need a little TLC and, and that's how I, that all will work. Um, let's see, it's almost time, it's almost time for me to start playing in the dirt outside and that's always very exciting. Thank you so much, Tracy. These earrings, I've had so many people ask me about these earrings and they're truly my favorites, not only because they're the cross, but because they go with everything. They're modern, they're classic. Um, and you know where I got them? I got them at a Hallmark store. And I will tell you that Hallmark stores have great jewelry such as this um, that are very, very... Hi, Violet! How are you? Um, um, very, very reasonably priced, like 6 or $7. They're not anything way over the top at all. So, um, so, so, so that's that. Um, but anyway, back to playing in the dirt. I do love to play in the dirt. And especially... Uh, okay, this is the infamous... B oh, we got 39 days. Okay, there she is. 39 days. And um, 39 days... Is, I, well, I was close. 40. I was doing quick math. And you know math is not our strong suit. So, um, <clears throat> but um, I am... So, I started to tell you, my husband gets... You know, it takes this much to get me sidetracked. 
Y'all know this. You watch me cook. You see me do it. What was I doing? Um, my husband brought home, from, he's always dragging stuff home from, from work, you know, and this looked too good to throw it away. Can't we use it? Okay, what do we got here? So he brought me this box. It's about this wide, about that wide. So whatever that is, about eight or 10 inches wide. It's about that deep, eight or 10 inches deep. And it's about six foot long. So he's going to put some legs on it and we're going to put it out on outside on my patio. And that's where, thanks, Vi, I appreciate that. Um, hey, Wilma, how are you? Thank you very much. Um, and we're going to put it out there and put dirt in it and put holes in the bottom of it. And that's where I'm going to grow my herbs this year. Oh, thank you so much for the stars. That's awesome. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, um, and, and thank you for all the hearts. I appreciate that. I truly do. That is just so sweet. Um, but I'm my favorite herbs to put out there are going to be um, basil. That is truly, I make more with basil than I probably do anything else. I mean, we eat caprese salads all summer long. We eat um, BLTs with, with um, basil. I make pesto. I love basil. Basil is awesome. So I will plant a lot of basil out there. I also like um, fresh oregano, Greek oregano, and I also like thyme. Those are kind of my go-to herbs in the summer and with, with you know, um, tomatoes and, and mozzarella cheese, especially fresh mozzarella cheese and a trip to the oil store. It's a party. I love it. So I'm excited about that. And I am going to put them on my porch um, and that will keep all of my unfriendly friends away, my little, uh, um, you know, things that gnaw on them and bugs and all that kind of stuff. So I'm excited about that. Um, I'm less excited about having to go back out there and clean up all that pollen off of that porch. I mean, you've seen me do it before. We've had this conversation for the past three years that I've been on here this time of year. All the pollen comes, it settles on all of my nooks and crannies, and you know I can't stand that. So I'm out there, on, and my husband's off this week, so I told him it would be a treat for him to help me. So he's really looking forward to that. Not so much, but it's okay. That's okay. I'll make sure it gets done, and we'll share in that little enjoying, enjoyable afternoon. Make it three, two or three day job into a one day job. If I'm the taskmaster, that is. So we'll see how that all goes. <laughs> so let's see, what else can I tell you? What else can I tell you? Um, I truly am looking forward to going to New Jersey. Um, you know, it's kind of like I get spring twice. Spring is sprung down here. I mean, truly, it's um, the, the um, azaleas are just absolutely spectacular. The... Um, uh, wisteria, oh my gosh, it just smelled. Hey, Deborah Redhead, how are you, girl? Um, the, it, I mean, it just smelled, oh my gosh, smelled so, so good. Um, it, I mean, just like violets, uh, just smelled wonderful. And um, I absolutely love cutting great big giant, uh, like pieces of azalea and, and making, you know, um, arrangements even if the, and they truly do last about a day I mean they truly do but you know what it's a day of pretty and who cares if you have to cut them every day what else are they out there for I mean it's wild stuff right so why not make a you know shake it off make sure you don't have any bugs in it but oh boy it makes a beautiful especially if just get a big old rubber made pitcher who cares what the pitcher looks like you know, you've got some branches of azalea and some wisteria. I've got fresh rosemary in it. It smells absolutely divine, and it should look, they just look beautiful. So I've had a lot of people ask um, about my tablescapes, and because, you know, playing with my tablescapes is kind of like playing with Barbies for me. Um, I mean, I love playing with my tables. As a matter of fact, um, one of the last times my girls were up here, I let them each uh, set up their own tablescapes. And I mean, you know, my um, my Raleigh and my Lily are both uh, 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 12. And 12, 12, yes. And then um, my little one is nine. 
And so the girls, the big girls did one together. And then my little girl did one with a little help from the big girls. And they had fun doing it. And it taught them how to set a table, whether they were paying attention or not. So it was kind of fun. So I've had a lot of, uh, a lot of you um, asking about... Um, we get spring on Thursday and then summer on Friday. You're exactly right, Martha. I mean, we can get four seasons in one day around here this time of year. Um, so I've had, so I have to kind of figure out how I'm going to do that. Um, because I can, I, you know, yes, I could do a live setting a table, but I, you know, just to, I don't know exactly how to take you along on that, on that process. So, um, maybe, you know, maybe I need to have somebody here with me so that, that, you know, I can say, okay, what do you like better? Do you want to do, I know I'm going to do a Cinco de Mayo here. So I'm going to do, um, one of those for Cinco de Mayo, which is coming up shortly. That'll probably be my next one. Um, I just have so many, so many table skates, so little time. So, um, anyway, um, well, thank you so much. I appreciate that, Arthur. I appreciate that. Arthur and Johnny, I appreciate the, 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 uh, wishes, um, uh, birthday wishes. And, well, hello, my star, my star Leanne. How are you, darling? Um, that's my sister. She's saying happy birthday. And, um, and so what part of New Jersey am I going to? I am going to the shore. I'm going down the shore. I'm going to, um, the Seaside Heights area. Um, so, uh, and it's beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. And that's what I started to say again, or get sidetracked. I get to have my springtime here and then I'll go up there and things will be, be in springtime up there too. So I get to have two springs and that's lovely. Um, so anyway, I have been blabbing and blabbing here and I really do appreciate, so do appreciate all of the birthday wishes. Like I said, I was overwhelmed when I went to my page today and there were 1,600 wishes and I'm like, oh my goodness, I will never be able to even send each and every one of you a heart that I just won't be able to do that. So, um, so I am saying thank you so very much. Is there anything that you, you know, I know that y'all would like to see, you know, I have, I know, I know I get a lot of questions about a cookbook and that is just something that it is such it is such a daunting task it is such a daunting task i mean i have put together so many um of my recipes and and you know it it's so technical technology kicks my bahonkas the truth is and so it's kind of like okay you get to this point and now what do you do so um, my friend, my BFF, has looked into some alternatives for me. So it's not a forgotten dream. And I, I mean, believe you me, I'd love to get it to you as much as you'd love to have it. So um, just know that it's something that, that is, it's, a, it's an ongoing project. So who knows? Maybe someday I'll be able to tell you that, that I have one. So um, I've, got, I've got several recipes together, just don't have, just don't have a format. So... Um, so I guess that's about all I have to say today. Um, I do appreciate you getting on here with me. Um, I am going to be watching, um, uh, thank you so much. That's so many, so many wonderful things. And, and I will get to sit down and read all of these tonight. Um, but, um, it's just so hard as they come up constantly for me to acknowledge everybody I would love to but it's just a little on the tough side so um so I appreciate it you all have a wonderful day I really do appreciate every one of you and um I will try to get on here more routinely on a live basis um in the future I really will so what do you think about doing a prime rib roast done covered in salt. Well, you know, I have my way of doing things. And, you know, if you go to my page, actually, I wonder, let's see if I can do this. I'm going to show you, I'm going to show y'all how to go to my page and how to search for anything you want to search for. We'll search for a prime rib. So here is my page, right? So 
right here is my page and over here are the three little three little dots can you even see that who knows and see the little three little dots you know star i <laughs> i should have taken a okay so there are three little dots here i want you to click on the three little dots and then it comes to this page and this page will tell you search search is down here so click on search Da -da -da -da. and that comes up your keyboard will come up and you're gonna and you can put in I'm gonna put in prime rib but you can put in cake you can put in cookies you can put in potatoes you can put it you don't have to have and everything that I do that are cake cookies potatoes corn salad dressing everything that I do with those words in it will come up so I'm going to put in uh, prime rib. I'm going to hit search and then it will come up. We're going to hope. Come on. You can do it. Prime rib search. Why is it whenever you're trying to do? Oh, it's, is it because that's on there? Maybe not. Who knows? Well, I have no idea why this is not working. Of course, you know, that's, if I'm on here live with you, it's not going to work. But that's how you want to do it. I will also, um, I will post, I will post how to do it. Don't ask me why it's not doing it. It's doing it because I'm trying to show you something. That's why it's not doing it. So, so anyway, um, um, but anyway, prime rib, I, you know, I do a salt rub with garlic and, um, pepper and prime rib. I mean, I'm sorry. And, uh, chopped fresh rosemary. And so that's just kind of how I do mine. So, um, anyway, it, so I want you to know though, I'm going to, I'm going to repost how to search because that every, when people are new, they, they have, Hey, Bendy, um, when people are new, they, they, they have missed on how to do a search. So they're constantly asking me for recipes and sometimes I can see them and sometimes I can't see them. So, um, that's why I periodically repost, um, our friend Tracy showed us how to do that. Yay. We love her forever. And, um, Hey Jackie. And so I will repost that. So you know how to look for anything you want to look for, because don't ask me why this does doesn't work because I want it to work. So that's how those things go. So, okay. I want you to all, um, have a wonderful day and I will be posting tomorrow. Like I said, I, I have those two that I'll post tomorrow and, um, I appreciate every single one of you. Y'all have a great day. Bye.